rocket science is all it's cracked up to be. Bringing together the mathematical, engineering and mechanical skills required to design, build, test and successfully launch a rocket into space is a mammoth technical undertaking. So many countries and corporations have the capacity for launches nowadays that they appear commonplace. Zero. Only the keenest science geeks seem to watch them these days, unless, of course, something goes wrong, and then everyone is hooked. リフトアップ、リフトアップ、HTV India's ISRO space organization has developed a range of vehicles for delivering satellites, either to polar orbit with the PSLV or geosynchronous with the GSLV Mark II. India has big plans for space development, one of which is to build a man-rated capsule. The Chinese Long March series of rockets has made steady progress and powers China's manned space program. Even they are becoming environmentally conscious as well. The Long March 5 heavy thrust cluster rocket with a loading capacity up to 25 tons is by far the largest carrier rocket China has. Compared with previous rockets, the biggest difference is the non-toxic propellant in hydrogen-oxygen engines and LOX kerosene engines that will not pollute the environment. And we applied serialization, unitization and modularization to design and manufacture. 